Well, of course, we don't know uh, exactly now how the negotiations will be, but uh, we have uh, interests in uh, the European Union, and that's because we would like to have uh, more uh, influence on the EU agenda and the directives that we are anyway taking taking into the Icelandic uh, legal system. But uh, I, I could never say now, at the moment, that, that it would be better to be inside because we don't know how the negotiation will, will go. I think we can learn that it is very important for us to get the right information out to the voters. So it's quite clear what we are going to vote about. If we get a, a result that we uh, can take to uh, to the nation for, for uh, a general uh, vote. I think it's very important we get the right information out. That, that's uh, something I think we can learn from the other Nordic countries. Mm. Well, if, if Iceland will become a member, I think uh, the Nordic uh, perspective will be uh, stronger in the European Union, because then you have a new Nordic country at the table. So it will give uh, the Nordic uh, countries more strength inside the EU. And it would also po probably uh, put uh, uh, the kind of system we have higher up on the agenda in the European Union, the welfare states, because Iceland is a welfare state like uh, other Nordic countries. So I, I think it could be quite important, both for the Nordic countries, but also for, for the European Union. And I, I'm also sure that for the Uni European Union it would be positive to have Iceland inside because of the where we are located up in the North Atlantic Ocean. Uh, so in a, in a kind of a geopolit uh, uh, in geopolitics, it's, it's quite important. We are, we are um, in the Arctic region, and uh, it will be more focused on the Arctic region in the future. And I would also stress that we are lying between U.S. and Russia, so it's, it's a kind of uh, important strategical uh, point.